Hello everyone, this is Ricky Says Good as Night Cats Fear, and we're here to continue a stall and to continue beating this game and to see if we can get any further in it. We're gonna try to see if we can beat the game because the game is not that far, it's not that long. It's a fantastic game, and I recommend you guys uh, giving it a try. Get the, the emulator for the Sega Saturn on, uh, on the Google App Store. Just put in a Sega Saturn emulator, and the first one that comes up, it has a gray thumbnail. That's the one. I can't pronounce the name that well, but um, it's the one that has a good score too, but it's a gray thumbnail. You guys will see it. It's free. It doesn't cost nothing. Let's see if we can jump on these guys like Super Mario. Doing some moonwalk jumping. It's a really good one. Oh, that's slipping around a little bit. This is a real wondrous, cool... It, this game kind of reminds me of uh, Dark Crystal with uh, Jim Henson. Created by Jim Henson. It really does remind me of it. Because of the crystals and because of the fantasy world and uh, the monsters and just just everything about it. It's a good thing it's short. And I think... That's like... Powers, like those circles around them, those are like powers. So you can gather the power. Oh, three, three hit combo there. Oh, see, right there, that monster looks like a monster you would see in Jim Henson or something like that. Get better get that light there. Oh yeah, this is actually a really fun level. You could also do that, which I didn't know. I, I forgot, you know, it's been so long. I forgot about that ability. Gonna bounce on that guy. You're probably gonna have to speed up this um, this gameplay too in editing because it's kind of slow a little bit. But it's because I think it's my cell phone. Um, it can't uh, handle the Sega Saturn games, I guess, for now. But I think that in the future, when I get either a better cell phone or um, the emulators will just get more better. Turn around! Get him! Get your buddy back! There we go. He kind of like has that habit of like, yeah, you know, like staying back in the air. But the thing is, though, is that when you get like a better, when when the emulators for the Sega Saturns get better, I mean for the for the Androids, you know, for Sega Saturn, Sega CD, PlayStation, PlayStation One, and all that, that's when um the efficiency will be better as well. And it'll play on almost any um, cell phone because most cell phones, most modern cell phones are very, they have a lot of memory already. But I think that I also need to get another cell phone just, just till then, you know, till that time comes. I think that within three or four years that should happen. I only got one hit, so I gotta be very careful. I better tell my little uh, bird to get some life for me. So I'm gonna switch and whistle is gonna get it up there. What are you doing? I told you to get the food. What are you doing? Oh, I'll just get it myself. Oh, well, I'm already close to the end already. Hey, don't, don't do that. Yeah, there you go. Jump. Jump! Oh! This is good. We're off to the second half. River of Dreams, let's see. Oh, that's real. Look at that. Look, you can't tell me that doesn't look beautiful right there. Look at that beauty. That's so, like, cool. I mean, this does remind me a lot about... Oh, oh I should have I should have gotten that life. I think, that, I think this punch is, like, to make me jump higher, I think. I think there's going to be some obstacles ahead. But look at that background. Look at the fog. Look how colorful the, that rock looks. That mountain back there. Look at that monster that you're on. 
So much detail, so much creativity, so much life. Looks like a painting. It's just a beautiful, great game, man. A classic game. The music is great, too. get some power here but the thing is that I need some life get the oh, no 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 I should have hit the guy oh. I should have hit him so I could bounce higher see if I could survive Is he helping me? Oh, yeah, he's helping me. Gotcha. Right in the face. What are you going to do, monster? Oh, I guess that made him go. Look at that sparkly, beautiful night sky. It's almost like, feels like you're there, you know? Yeah. But the thing is, though, is that I'm not speaking too much because I'm kind of nervous. Look at the foreground flowers there. Oh, almost. You see that? Almost got me. I'm not going to play that game anymore. The thing is, though, is that what I was saying is that I'm a little bit nervous. I'm not talking because I'm nervous that I might die and I don't want to have to, like, play the level again. Stop. What, what did I do? Duck, 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 duck. It's a good thing this guy kneels down very low. Let's see if he could do a twofer here. Oh yeah, that's good. That was a good one. Let's see if he could do a threefer. Oh yeah, good, good. Oh no. Nope, jump. Oh, right there. That's a close one. That was a close one. I'm gonna do some ducking. Man, I'm barely surviving. Barely surviving. Okay, get up. Jump. Oh. It's like stop, drop, and roll and time this guy. Nope. Duck, 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 duck. Oh, he, the thing that sucks about hitting him like that is that it takes a long time for him to, uh... Oh, I got hit. He's like, oh, shucks. Press the button. You give me the fruit, please. So slow. So here we are. We skipped ahead. I was kind of close a little bit to dying a little bit. You can see the little fishes there on the way. The heck, the damn turtles making me bounce up and down. I want to see the fishes. I want to see the graphic. I want to see the graphical artistry. Okay. You press A to so you can drop the little fruits. And it's right there. Just in case you need it. Oh, man. Well, I got hit and I got knocked back. But I mean, you can't hate on this game that much, man. Like, this game, even when I was younger, I knew that this game was, like, kind of short. But, like, graphically, it, it's, like, it's very beautiful. And it's, like, um, a treasure. You know, like, I don't know if it's like, a, like a treasure that you don't hate on. It's, like, a piece of art that uh, isn't the best, isn't the biggest. 
It doesn't have a lot going for it, except that it's very artistically well done and passionately well done. That's all you have. And it's like a, it's just, it's just a great game. I would think of it like as like a little mini game, kind of, you know, but very cool mini game. I kind of wish I played this game when I was even, even younger. Look at that. Look how dense the environment is. Dense with the art, you know. Those uh, flowers and stuff like that. It's like a swamp. Great background design, you know. Oh, barely made it. I'm just gonna bounce on that guy if I can get on him before. And this should be the end, right? I mean, come on now. Thank you, turtle. Thank you. And that was a look at that fish right there flopping around. And we did it. Hopefully, we'll see a boss. And I, I don't know how much levels there is, but I know that there's only three or four worlds or levels or whatever. Just look at that glow on those little uh, flower things. There. Looks like the turtle's biting that thing. The forest fiend. So that must mean a, an enemy, a boss. It's been so long, I forgot that this was even here. Looks like he's starting to kind of manifest. The flowers are tilting forward. The energy, the chi energy of the flowers are entering and creating this monster. This boss. Oh, that's a scary looking boss right there. Gonna have to be running for this one. Gonna do a power. What is Are you gonna attack or what? What are you gonna do? What is he doing? What are you doing, Birdie? You're supposed to attack him. Oh, well, I got him anyways, you jerk. Ugh, looks like a hand. And sorry, I can't move that well because, like, the game... I'm using, a uh, The screen. There's something creepy about a plant that its face is also a hand. I don't know about... Something strange about that. But I'm hitting him, and I'm attacking him. See how that went very weird looking there. But such an awesome arena. Such an awesome looking boss. I don't know what that's doing. I think it's supposed to pick it up. Yep. And I think I know why I was going to... Oh, oh. Why don't you come down lean down a little bit. Hey, I know what you're going to do. Hey, 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 get out of here. He's going to try to like come down at me. It's a weird, weird sound he makes. Come on, calm down. Lean down a little bit. You know you want to. Gotcha. I think the bird is trying to show you where to hit him. I think that's what that yellow crystal thing is like. So we're going to try to pull out these plants roots. Didn't get me. Oh, this guy's going to move around now. I think we're going to go around circles. Like a lot of Sega Saturn games, the bosses always go around circles. Oh, no, I guess not. Just gonna maneuver around a bit. Still got you. Uh oh. It kind of looks like if you look at the background, look at the plants back there. It kind of reminds me of uh, Tim Burton's Night Rift Before Christmas. Uh oh. Better stay away. It looks like he's gonna try to grab me. Yeah, he tried to. Gotcha. Oh yeah. We did it, we did it, we did it. And those plants, those orange plants remind me of Halloween, they're all orangey. I must say that the floor looks exquisite. The floor looks so smooth and so well done. It doesn't even look like it belongs in a Saturn game. Epic music. 
And we did it. Let's do a slam. That's for little success dance thing. Walk away. <laughs> Walk it away. That orb right there. I like the little 8 bit, 16 bit crystal uh, sparkles there. There's something special about the 16 8 bit uh, sparkles, man. Little cut scene here. Tell him the snake looks like a little dog or something, like a cat or something. And there's the evil stall. It's showing you how to play. This level is really, really cool too. Oh, he's spinning around like kill across from outer space. Oh, dang it. <clears throat> Gonna look for some life for me. Thank you. Oh, man, if I didn't have that bird, I don't know what I would do. Like a there we go. Oh, blew him away. That was real cool. <clears throat> this is a really different type of uh, way to introduce the game. You know, like the different type of levels. They try to make it more dramatic, very dynamic. We'll blow that a little bit, then jump over very quick because the fire comes back very fast. Blow that guy away. Do some running. I'm gonna run instead. Oh, damn it. Sounds like wolves or something like that. Get a jump. Oh, I'm gonna get him. Get a jump, jump. Ooh. Damn it. Get me some life, so get me some life there, birdie. What's this? Oh, yeah, thank you. Oh, look at that background. Look at those rocks falling. Such a dynamic, powerful level. If I had to recommend any games, I'd recommend playing this one. This one is really good, too. But what I'm going to do also, I'm trying to get a controller for the Android so I could play the games better. Rather for recording or just to play generally, casually. Oh, you see a rock here. What is he going to do? What is he going to do? I'm going to pick it up. Pick it up. There you go. That can also protect you, I suppose, too. But I think, if I remember, we need to cover up a volcano top opening volcanic opening look at that guitar riff too very beautiful music and we're already here at the end of the level see if we could oh, i guess i can't let's gonna try to see if we could oh oh that's to close the volcano oh and there it is See that background right there? Clog the volcano. That's what I was supposed to do. See where it takes us now? Maybe it's going to be inside a volcano this time. 
guarding a fire. I think this is already a boss already. Ooh, look at that. The stalactite. Continue, we'll continue though. So I guess we have to blow on this guy. I don't think it's gonna be that difficult. I think that uh So Okay. We hit the body. What does that do to the head? It's gonna, it's gonna go back, it's gonna go back. Whoa. Oh, okay, so what it is is that you have to like beat the body up and then. Come on. This guy is probably not gonna be so straightforward. <clears throat> Duck right there. This is an awesome battle arena, I'm going to say, though. Oh, yeah, that got a height. Just a few more times and you're out of here. Let's start to look for some. So all we need to do is just blow on this guy. Oh yeah, we defeated him. Yeah. We done good. Look at that background. Look at that dramatic, beautiful, badass background right there. So there you go, guys. We'll continue this uh, next time because the video is getting kind of long. But we'll do part three and finish the game for show. Take care. God bless everybody. Yeah, this is the final level. I remember now.